Welcome back to Big Bob's MTG, Strixhaven School of Mages once again. Here we go with a full set box of cards. No more pre-release packs, we're all out of those and golly, they are using much better plastic for their boxes, that's for sure. Don't worry, there's a protective layer underneath those so I'm not damaging any cards or anything like that. All right. Beautiful. Now I kind of do like the, the whole browns and purples and whatnot of this set. I like the, the color scheme that they chose for this. It's kind of fun, much different. All right. This is good to go. Uh, yeah. Go like this. There we go. So, let's go start with these. Now this one uh, has the art cards. Beautiful art cards. So that's pretty awesome. I like those art cards, so. All right, we got our land, which we'll put down here. Uh, commons and whatnot. Uncommons, jeez. Arena's being a little bit extra today. Uh, audio, come on. That's better. <laughs> Drowned me out. All right. Uh, Purglist, first one up. As well as Grape Shot. Really good pull so far. And our first foil is Show of Confidence. And this is what we're going to do from now on. So here's the deal. We're going to save these. So, uh, let's see, where's my baggie? I have a baggie around here that I am going to collect. Here it is. Here it is. So, all of the ad cards that we get from Wizard of the Coast are going in the baggie. So, uh, yep, I'm going to keep this at my feet so I can just toss them down there. Uh, but just know that they are going in there and I'll update you as we go along our adventures with wizards ads in their cards. <laughs> cool. Hey, I like that. That's fun. All right. Ooh, first off the lesson is basic conjuration. It's the rare one. Look at the top six cards of your library. You may reveal a creature card from among them. Put it in your hand. Put the rest in the bottom of your library in a random order. You gain three life. Really cool. All right. So commons, uncommons, and conspiracy theorist. As well as a thrill of the possibility and a bullfrog befuddler. And our uh, list card is the... Con coveted peacock when it attacks you may goad target a player defending player or defend target creature defending player controls wow okay i forgot that the list card were actually a thing <laughs> okay here we go yep <sighs> really excited to get into these some more super cool Love that. That is awesome. <laughs> uh, Alright, our lesson is indoctrination in prophecy. Okay. Let's see. Un Commons. Uncommon is one. <laughs> we have the Blade Historian. Oh, I haven't had this card. Oh, look at that. I have a Dean of Perfection. And Nasari, Dean of Expression. Super cool. And Defiant Strike is our DFC. Oh, look at that. Wow. Vernal Equinox. I don't actually remember this card from Mercadian Masks. Any player may play a creature in enchantment spell anytime he or she could in an instant. 
Wow, that's a good one to pull. Holy crap. I don't know if that one is seeing any uh, movement, but kind of excited to see. <laughs> oh, I know this card. This card turns all your creatures into the same creature. I just dropped it. I just dropped it. Okay, so it's back. <laughs> all right, and there's our land. Uh, lesson, right? Eureka moment. Commons, okay. And uh, elite spellbinder. Ooh, an abundant harvest. Hell yeah. Beautiful card. Thunderous orator. And oh, almost got one. But it's got a token on it, so we won't we won't throw it away. There, there, little inkling. You are safe for now. <laughs> Alrighty. Alright. Planes. Mercurial transformation. Let's skip through the commons, get to the uncommons. Lorehold apprentice. Returned past caller. Oh, wow! Holy cow! Judging! Galazeth Prismari. Alt art, full borderless version. Wow, that's cool. That is our first mythic of this box. Strategic planning and sign in blood. Oh, man. Wow, I want to see how much this guy is worth. That is so cool. Oh man, where's my freaking sleeves? Jeez. Love the way these cards look. You know, they, they do kind of look and feel Pokemon-esque. But with, like, this is Sigil and Blood. Pokemon would never do something like that. But it's, it's still really, really cool. Let's see, where am I going to put this guy? <laughs> I'm going to put them right here above the rares, huh? All right, here we go. So far, we have a really good uh, list card. We got a, a alt art mythic. Uh, we got a foil sign in blood. Jeez, I cannot complain about this so far. Oh, man. And another Magnus Opus. Beautiful. And a snake skin veil. So that's uh, mythic number two. Oh, so close. Elemental, you saved the ad. Why did you do that? Just let the ad die. We want to add it to the bucket. Oh, and then there's Magnus Opus, the art card. Beautiful. Look at that big elephant guy. <laughs> All right, land. Uh, lesson. Here we go. Digging through. Okay. Here we go. Creative Outburst. Prismari Command. Beautiful. And Swords to Plows. And our foil is the Moldering Karak. And a Treasure Token. Okay. Well, looks like we got another list card. That'll be cool. This is the Switch Your Hand in Graveyard one. The Harness of Infinity. Yeah. All right. Island. Foil Island. Uh, commons. Let's chew through those. Yep, there we are. Professor of Symbiology. Clever Lumina Lumimancer. And the Biblioplex. Great card. Look at the top card of your library. If it's an instant or sorcerer card, you may reveal it and put it into your hand. If you don't, if you don't put the card into your hand, you may put it into your graveyard. Activate only if you have exactly zero or seven cards in your hand. Opt is our mystical archive card and a study break, as well as a muscle sliver. From the list. Wow, that's cool. 
I think I have some more muscle slivers around here, but I don't really feel like going to get them. So here we go. <sighs> Diving in. So these packs are a little bit more taut. They're not so loosey goosey, so they're a little bit harder to dig into. Oh, that's cool. All right. Expanded um, anatomy. Ooh, lots of uncommons in this one. Overgrown Arc, Mortality Spear, Wither Bloom Apprentice, and Auric Lorman. Nice. And, oh, cool. Shally Dean of Radiance. And Ambrose, Dean of Shadow. Beautiful. Village Rites is our mystical archive. And the Silver Quill Apprentice. Super pretty. All right. Art card. Ah. Or ad card. That's what I should say. <laughs> All right. Come on. Show us the good stuff. Some super cool fractals. Hey, we just got this guy, didn't we? That's Ibrahim. I know that. He is the other side of one of the girls that we got. Uh, I forget what this girl's name is, but these two go on the same card. So if you look here, Kian, Dean of Substance, and this is Ibrahim, Dean of Theory. Cool. All right, land card. Lesson card. Common, 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 common. Uncommon. Cool. Spell satchel. Ooh, another magnum opus. That's interesting. <laughs> oh. Shall oh my God. That is amazing. Yeah, this is a common foil. Who cares? And this is a uh, spirit. Cool. Jesus. I wonder how much this guy is going for right now. All right, I have to look it up. Hold on. Okay, so it's only five bucks, but its foil version is 45 bucks. <laughs> Not foil, but that's still a beautiful card. Super cool to get some of these specialty cards. All right, so we're at three Mythics so far. Uh, some really nice art cards. No uh, signed cards yet. There we go that and uh uncommon lesson squirrel guy this squirrel's kind of funny he's a two two for two with reach and he gets plus two plus two as long as you have eight or more lands that's pretty slick clever lumamancer silver quill apprentice and venerable war singer and oh, 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 oh my god Judging. tainted pact as well as a foil environmental sciences and a pest. Wow. God, I wish this was foil. Oh my gosh. Exile the top card of your library. You may put that card into your hand unless it has the same name as another card exiled this way. Repeat the process until you put a card into your hand or you exile two cards with the same name, whichever is first. Ah. Oh. How much is that worth? Holy cow. This is worth $44 right now. Foil, it's 133 Holy crap. Ooh. Wow, that is an awesome card. I need this guy right here. All right. Just like the card that I pulled a little bit earlier, I was just kind of cracking open some of the uh, bonus packs you get with the pre-release kits. And I pulled uh, this boy right here. Ready for it? Boom. Demonic Tutor. I was so excited for this. God, isn't that a beautiful card? So awesome. But yeah, that's worth 45 bucks alone right now, too. Tainted Pack is our fourth mythic. 
of this box so far. Not even halfway through. Oh man, this is so cool. All right. Here we go, the art card. Land. Lesson le common common. All right. And ooh, the retriever phoenix. Ooh, I've heard it. And a shock, a beautiful shock. Look at that. That's cool. Exhilarating elec elocution. Cool. What is the list? It's something that needs to get better. Because <laughs> right now, these set boosters are not worth it for the list cards. Uh, I, ha I have yet to see anybody really pull something am amazing. Uh, maybe the Vernal Equinox is something. I'm going to go check on that after this. Oh, there we go. Signed art card. Bam. Gold swooshes. Doesn't even look like a signature, but it is. But it is. All right. Land. Common, 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 common. All right, here we go. Explosive welcome. Baleful mastery and divine gambit. It's followed by a ripped apart. This is actually a pretty good card. Three damage to target creature, planeswalker, and destroy target artifact or enchantment. Really great, especially with the lore hold. And another elemental token. Cool. All right. Oh, it looks like we might have gotten a list card. We'll have to see, huh? So, there's our art card. Art card. Gotta like the art card. So, um, let's see. Common, common, common. So, that was a lot of common. So, one uncommon. A dramatic finale. Beautiful. And Lightning Helix. We've already received one of these that was foil. But this is a really cool card. And the Witherbloom play, Pledge Mage. Super. Oh, shit. Hello. Fomori Nomad. Nomad Giant. 4-4 four, four creature for 5. Yeah, that's one of the list cards. Why would they... <sighs> cool, but... So what? Does <laughs> is, is, is anybody actually use that at all? I mean... <sighs> like, this thing up on the top corner. Is that, like, first strike? Like, what does this guy do? Anyone know? I'll have to look it up, but I don't really feel like it right now. Oh, I said I would look up to see how much uh, Vernal Equinox is worth. Hang on here. Okay, so it's only a buck and a half. That's fine. All right. Still think the list needs to get a little more powerful. Something more desirable to actually make people want to buy these things. Like, jeez. Super cool. <laughs> Ink mages. All right, so foil mountain. Indoctrination of prophecy is our lesson. All right, we got some extra uncommons here with archmage emeritus. One of the really one of the really good cards in this set. Like it is just he is so good. Cast a spell, draw a card. Yeah, sorry my uh fingernails a little bit dirty tonight i was uh grilling so you know it is what it is but uh flame scroll celebrant and the agonizing remorse as well as reveal revel in silence all right oh and we have a foil divine gambit we're super pretty oh that's really cool wow and a fractal token. So let's grab this. All right. There it is. Here we go. We're a little more than halfway through. Sorry, this video is going to be a little bit longer. I am having some fun just going through and, uh, you know, 
really looking into how much these cards are worth, what they are, and yeah, it's just a fun time. I like this set a lot. I don't think it feels nearly as impactful as Kaldheim. Uh, the Kaldheim cards seem to work together. A Culling Ritual. All right. Ephemerate. Oh, wow. Uh, exile target creature you control, then return to the battlefield under its owner's control. Rebound. If you cast the spell from your hand, exile it as it resolves. At the beginning of your next end step upkeep, you may cast this card from exile without paying its mana cost. Interesting. That's a good one. Let's just see how much that one's worth. And an avatar token. The blood avatar. <laughs> yeah, I'll see you later. I don't want to damage any cards. I'm trying to even the cards out in the packs. Yeah, I don't know. Who knows? Who knows? Who actually knows? Nobody actually knows. Oh, wow. That's one of the Japanese cards. Oh, that's so cool. Look at that. Oh, wow. I know this is one of the Japanese alt cards. Uh... Tendrils of Agony. Super awesome. All right, so land, environmental studies. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Torment Sculptor and Infuriate. As well as a Biomathematician and an Ink Token. So this guy, Torment Sculptor, Ward 2. Now, Ward is a new spell or ability. When this creature becomes the target of a spell or ability and opponent controls, counter it unless that player pays two colorless more. Beautiful. So Ward is actually a fun ability. Uh, this is the sorcery side of it. Two mana. Uh, discard a card and then draw a card. When you discard an instant or sorcery card this way. Flames it on a deals damage equal to that card's convert to mana cost to target creature or planeswalker you don't control. Bam! That's a good one. That is a great card. Okay. <clears throat> so no more mythics so far. Which is fine. There is our, I think this is the Quandrix uh, Apprentice, right? Yep. Oh, the Quandrix Progeny. <laughs> All right. Uh, the Mountain. Commons Down. Rip Apart. Uh, Grinning Ignis. And the Manifestation Sage. Oh, 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 oh my God. Hell yes. It, oh. Wow. Okay. Okay. Thumbs up for this pack. <laughs> Holy shit. Gazeth Prismari, once again, his actual full, or his actual real card, as well as Indoctrinated Vengeance, or Increasing Vengeance. <laughs> and I am not bright. Novice Dissector. And here's one of our uh, Dominarios. One player, one pack. Actually, we should try to play this sometime. <laughs> so we'll keep that one because it's not an ad card. This is Increased Vengeance. I'm going to go see how much this one is. Okay, so nothing too fancy or special, but, you know, three bucks. That's not so bad. That, Nahiri, I think, yeah. Yeah, it looks like Nahiri to me. <laughs> is this Nahiri too? No, that's not Nahiri. This isn't Nahiri. Who is this? I want to know who this is. Somebody comment down in the comments section. I want to know who that is. All right. Let's see. Getting together with our pest token. Whoa. That is so cool. What, what card is this? Like, what is this? Thrill of possibility. But the, I, I'm assuming this is either that... Uh, the 
uh, Mystical Archive one. Uh, let's let's go see. After this pack, okay. All right. So we got commons, uncommons, 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 and uh, Elite Spellbinder. Beautiful. All right. Negate and a thrilling discovery and a pest token. All right. So I think I got a thrill of possibility. Let's see here. Uh. Now, if anyone else has noticed, these cards feel so much different. There it is. Thrill of Possibility. So that is it. So who is that in the picture? Huh? Do we know? This one says Nas Nasari. Prismari Dean. But that's not Nasari, is it? That looks maybe like a silver quill, or maybe they're just like shadowing out, like, uh, who's the planeswalker the evil planeswalker in this one uh oh i forget her name kazmina that's what it is who knows all right let's keep going oh there's our big boy he showed up twice so far this is the third too bad it's not signed huh mr prismari himself expanded anatomy there we are and, ooh, Frost Boil Snarl. This is the new land set, the Snarl. Apparently there's lots of snarling going on, but these are cool. Uh, I wish they were island or uh, mountain, but if you reveal the island or mountain, it comes into play untapped. So that's not so bad. Oh, cool, a two, a two rare pack. Gnarled Professor. Super awesome. Looking gorgeous. How many hands does this guy have? One, two, three. Ah, it's too many. Anyway, comes into play. Learn. <laughs> and compulsive research. Beautiful card as always. Oh, and a foil. Bibli Biblioplex. Biblioplex. Beautiful card. Gotta love that. I wish it was like a alt art or full art version, but I don't think I can get those in here, so I'll put that right there. Nice! I like it. Come on. Open the hell up. Come on. Come on out. Actually, this one might be keepable. Hang on here. Mm. Mm. Looks keepable, right? Yeah. Okay, here we go. Putting it into our pack. So far, we have a lot of blues. And actually, I was not able to keep uh, a time spiral one because I accidentally ripped it. Super sad about that, but that's okay. Gonna have to just buy another pack of, uh, or another uh, box of time spiral for sure. All right, let's get to this pack now. Art card, super pretty. It's an island. Who is that? Oh, I know who that is. I know who that is. Hey, we already got this guy, didn't we? Hey. Doesn't that look like it? Maybe. <laughs> Who knows? Oh well. Art. Let's go. Let's go. Alright, so commons, go away. Uh, secret rendezvous. Rendezvous. Rip apart. Grinning Ignis. Explosive iteration. And a Dragon Guard Elite. I think for me this is number six. <laughs> Snakeskin Vile. What an idiot! Vale. Sorry, I'm stupid. A treasure token and a campus for Quandrix. Quandrix. Boop, boop, boop. Ooh, wow. Now that's pretty. I know we just got that one in uh, the Mystical Archive card, so that's cool. They really expanded these art slots. Uh, 81. 81 cards for that. All right. So land. Uh, our lesson is 
an uncommon. That's nice. A little change of pace. All right. Um, and a vanishing verse. Exile target mono colored permanent. Sweet. Duress and Zimon. The Quandrix Prodigy and an Elemental. No ad cards to rip up yet, but I know there will be a lot in those draft booster packs. So, oh, looks like we got another list card. Super excited for that. And Cosmia. Cosmina showing her face in the art card slot. Beautiful. I like this Planeswalker a lot. I think they did a really great job on uh, her art there. So, all right. Quandrix Cultivator and Conspiracy Theorist. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hor Hoffrey. The Ghost Forge. Wow. Spirits, you control with plus one, plus one, and have trample and haste. Holy shit. Right? Whenever another non token creature you control dies, exile it. If you do, create a token that's a copy of that creature, except it's a spirit in addition to its other types. And it has when this creature leaves play, the leaves the battlefield, return the exiled card to your graveyard. Just amazing. So that is mythic number one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven so far. Revitalized, looking beautiful as ever. And we got Shawing! the Inventor's Fair from the list. At the beginning of your upkeep, if you control three or more artifacts, you gain one life. Well, that's pretty slick. Tap, add one mana to your mana pool. Uh, for sacrifice. Search your library for an artifact card. Reveal it, put it into your hand, and then shuffle your library. Activate this ability only if you have three or more artifacts. Pretty awesome. All right, so we're almost done here. More than halfway gone with the third stack in this box. So, beautiful art card. It's super cool. Got the, I got the Ori, Auric. I want to call it the Ori because of uh, freaking, um, oh, what is it? Uh, Stargate. That's what it is. I'm coming. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I just saw what I got in this pack. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, accumulation of studies. Fine. Okay. Cool. Great. Uh, weather the storm. Oh my god. Yes. Foil. Day of judgment. <laughs> Shot wing. Oh my god. Oh. You. Just beautiful. I want to know how much this card is. Oh, jeez. Holy cow. All right. I'll be right back. Gonna find out how much this guy is. Well, I am super disappointed. And I blame all of you. <laughs> so this card is only worth about 17 bucks. Ugh. Still so pretty. Such a beautiful card. Definitely putting that baby in a sleeve immediately. Alright. Beautiful card regardless. Mythic number. Let's see, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight mythics in this box. Alright, so let's get to the next one. So, our Ink Mage, what is this? The, uh, yeah, the Shadewing Lariette. Beautiful, land. Here we go. Return past color, 
exponential growth. Super cool. And another Duress. Detention Vortex. Oh, this card feels very stiff compared to the other ones. Uh, yeah, a little bit more stiff. Like, slightly more stiff. Uh, he's... Ah, I totally lost. Shoot. Here we go. Oh, what is that card? Defiant Strike. Okay. Yeah, we have that one in there. Cool. All right. Forest card. Containment Breach. Thrilling Discovery. There we go. And there's our Snarl. Fury Calm Snarl. What does that mean? Fury Calm? Really? Pestilent Cauldron. Tezzeret's Gambit. Restorative Burst. Super cool. A really pretty card. Tezzeret's Gambit. That's I love these. God, I just love these. Uh, squirrel co <laughs> Skurid Colony. <laughs> is, is that a mis misprint? Like... Did they mean to say Skurid? Whatever. Maybe it means something else that I don't know. Looks like another list card. And look at that. The Dragon Guard Mage. Looking pretty as ever. With her uh, big old needle boob. She only has one boob. And it has, or maybe it's a fin. Like a dragon fin. But it looks like her like titty. Can I say titty on YouTube? I wonder. Maybe I'll get uh, punched in the mouth. Oh, only two commons this time around. That's pretty nice. So lots of uncommons. We've got the Spell Satchel. Uh, Storm Kiln Artist. Team Pennant. Uh, Zephyr Boots. Uh, Umbral Juke. Mascot Interception. And Poet's Quill for the rare. Adventurous Impulse, and, a, ooh, a foil, a foil shock. Probably not, like, high dollar, but still great. Oh, look at that, too. Triplicate Spirits. Three white spirits with flying onto the battlefield. Convoke. Super cool. Put that one there, and this one is going to get a sleeve. Because I love these Mystical Archive foils. They just look amazing. Don't you say so too? Ah, oh, that's so cool. Bam. Okay. Three packs left. Three left. We're going to do the last pack first. Here we go. It's the Witherbloom campus, right? Or the forest. <laughs> Just a forest. Who knew? <laughs> Alrighty. Here we go. Practical research. Silver Quill Silencer. Oh! Extus Auric Overlord. Awesome. And then Awaken the Blood Avatar. <laughs> Beautiful card. That is number nine for our Mythics. Cultivate. Another version of Cultivate. Did we really need that? Did we really need... Ah! Fodder. Ah! So Wizards of the Coast can expect a shipment soon because <laughs> i am going to ship every last art card they send me back to their damn warehouse uh, i don't want the crap i don't pay for your damn ads i pay for the cards super cool that's the wither bloom command right yeah my wrist doesn't bend like that Yep, with a moon command. There it is. All right. There we go. Foil land. 
There's that. Zimone, once again. Decisive denial. Solve the equation. And sl sliver... <laughs> Silver Quill Silencer, as well as a regrowth. Nice. Return target card from your graveyard to your hand. For two mana, that's not so bad at all. And a Tangle Trap. Oh, 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 oh. Spirit. Some people hear it. Some people fear it. Spirit. Some people just won't go near it. Strix Haven's last pack in this booster box. All righty. Here we go. Oh, that's fun. What is that card? Oh, that's the Silver Quill guy. Uh, Shadrick's Silver Quill. Cool. Oh, there we go. Another rare lesson. Academic probation. You're on probation, motherfucker. Nice. All right. Commons. Uncommon. Culling Ritual. And Ott is our last and final guy. Oh. Oh. Look at you. Oh. There's another one. Booster Sleuth. Ifrit Flame Painter. Double strike. One four creature. Whenever it deals combat damage to a player, you may cast target instant or sorcery card from your graveyard without paying its mana cost. If that spell would be put into the graveyard this turn, exile it instead. Wow, that's cool. All right. Let's get me this one in here. Uh, swoop the hoop. Beautiful. Boom. So that's it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this box opening, as well as the pre-release kits that are coming out slowly but surely. I don't want them to be all in one. I know I've seen a lot of videos, uh, Joey Moss and everything, but, you know, I'd prefer to see, you know, highlight the cards a little bit. That's what we're here for, right? Highlight the cards. Cultivate, Adventurous Impulse, Tezzerous Gambit, Duress. So pretty. So cool. Thank you for joining me, guys. I really appreciate you stopping by. Please like and subscribe. Comment down below. I want to see what you guys think of these. If you guys want to see any more, please let me know what you would like to see. And I would gladly try to oblige. Thank you very much. Have a good night.